Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Matt and I do like video games and in today's video we're here on Xbox Series S to play Dead Island 2. I already started two characters and I messed up both recordings. So I gotta do this quick. Um, we're gonna just start a new, new game. I'm skipping the intro. We're getting right into it. I mean, you're gonna hear me. I just played a lot of this and you're gonna hear me be amazed again all over because I, I, I gotta be honest with you guys, I absolutely love this game. I absolutely love this game. Oh yeah, this is a, uh, ooh, forgot about that. That's not good. So I'm gonna start by saying, I noticed my videos for a while now haven't been quality, haven't been quality videos and it's been driving me crazy. I've been trying to figure out why. Um, turns out I was using the wrong cable on my um, capture card because all my videos, while being captured at 60 FPS and rendered at 60 FPS, the game itself wasn't actually being shown at 60 FPS, like on my PC. Like on the input it was, but on my PC it wasn't. So even though all my videos are 60 FPS, all the gameplay I saw was 60 FPS, it wasn't 60 FPS in the video. I've switched out the cable, it is now 60 FPS, and it looks better than it did before too, on top of that. And it's perfect that we're starting it off with this game because this game looks amazing. We're on Series S, and by the way, shout out to Damn Buster Studios because look at this. We've got an FOV slider on Series S with 60 FPS. I have this thing all the way up to 100. You will notice throughout this video that it is very, very smooth. And I'm just gonna speed my way through this because Hello? I'm trying to get to the part that I just played because that's where I was really amazed. There was some stuff back there to pick up, but I'm not picking it up. I'm not worried about it. I'm trying to get I'm trying to get to where I was. I honestly never even looked in here. That door always opened and I just ran past it. Dude, he got his shit caved in. Oh no. Did he poop himself too? Oh, that's not good. I think he pooped himself. Imagine becoming a zombie and then the last thing you remember before your brain switches over to that is you shitting yourself. That's probably not a good feeling. Probably feels pretty whack, I'm not gonna lie. Almost there. You firing those bloody oh. What was that? There's something in the plane. Stay back. I'm in the plane. It's me. I just open the door and they open fire. They kill me, game's over. By the way, I picked Danny. Um, and the reason I picked Danny, if you're curious, uh, her skill traits, basically she's a tank. And then on top of that, she's a punk rock chick, and that's my type of lady. Oh. Uh, I didn't realize you couldn't kill him without walking up to him. You had to see him first. There we go. They can be. I need a better weapon. A better weapon like this sledgehammer, like this modified sledgehammer. Oh yeah. Who else wants some? Get bonked. Get your head caved in. Come on now. Oh, she's missing her arms. That's not good. And her head. Dude, two and one. I played this part through. This is my third time playing this part. That's still awesome. And you're done. Later. Dude, the flesh system on these zombies is probably the most impressive thing. Like, I'll say the flesh system on these zombies is even better than the flesh system at uh, Dead Space Remake. Which is impressive. I didn't expect to say that so soon. Like the way you just hit zombies and pretty much all of their skin falls off. Damn. And you're dead. Where was I? 
We were helping this fine young gentleman. The game looks really good. Wake up now, Bjor. Can you hear me? That's a zombie. Have a drink of water for me. That's a zombie. You don't, don't touch. Don't touch. That's a zombie. Oh. Oh. Damn. Oh. Got a heal in the eye. Okay. Now this guy's turning. What you just saw there is not too far off from what you'll see in game with the flesh system. Like, yeah, that was a cutscene, but that's not very far off from what you'll see in game. And that's amazing. Super fast load times, as you would expect. We are in next gen, of course. All right. Somehow I'm pretty now sure this I'm is where I was, and guys, I cannot wait to show you. I cannot wait to show you what what it was that blew my mind. I am a jaunt. You gotta go down here real quick. Open sesame. Grab yourself the circuit breaker. Circuit breaker. Metal parts. See, I don't know what all this stuff does. I'm assuming it's like all used to like craft and there stuff, but I haven't done any crafting yet, so I don't know. Like, dude, look at that. That's a really good looking game. I'm super interested to see what this looks like on Series X, because if this is the Series S, like we're locked at 60 this? FPS. At least that's what it feels like. Where's my power attack? Come on. And you're done. And you're done. Come on. Come get it. Come get it. And you're done. <laughs> I love this game, man. I really love this game. There's not many games where I could play the intro three times because I screwed up twice and still thoroughly enjoy it. This is one of those games. Dude, look at that. Like, I just ripped open his chest cavity with a sledgehammer. How, how was this not the coolest Hello? game? You zombie. Can't get through here. I didn't even notice this chick last time. Is she a zombie? Dude, her brain is jiggling around inside her. Dude, if ever there was a chance of my channel being monetized, this would not be the video to do it. This would be the video. This would be the video that gets my channel demonetized if ever I was monetized. It's Colt Swanson. I'm beating the shit out of Colt Swanson. Just caved his head in. Oh, hello. Whoa. Oh, I missed my time. I was not expecting that. Kick his head in. There we go. Open up that weapon wheel. Actually, we have an axe? Hold on now. This is the thing that was so amazing. There's Alexa game control. What that means is I can... It says hold pause for a short time, then speak to enter to use a command. Now, watch this. Hey, over here. Like, how... How fucking sick is that? Oh, there goes her arm. Dude. And then we can do it to this guy, too. Hey, you. <laughs> That's 
that's like the dude that's like the coolest thing i've seen in a game in a long time and that last recording that i messed up i i said this and i meant it that's the coolest thing i've seen in a game like that's the coolest use of voice commands i've seen in a game since like sports games at the end of the 360 when you had connect you would get technical fouls whenever you cursed in a sports game like for me it was always 2k whenever i whenever i would just curse because of some nonsense in the game i got a technical foul i need some relief oh matron that was weirdly sexual but god bless do your thing i'm not hating it Oh. Oh. Come on. Here we go. Get over here. Oh, I want to do the voice control. Dude, this is, the combat is so satisfying. I can't explain to you guys how, just how perfect the combat is in this game. Oh, hello. What other weapon do I have? Pull, pull Q? Oh, there's another one. I didn't even see this one. You're about to get axed. You're about to get axed. And you're done. That is just some of the most satisfying gameplay I've seen all year. Okay, I gotta stop because it's about 1 o'clock. I still need to edit this and get it uploaded for 11 a.m. And that's less than 10 hours from now. So I gotta stop. All in all, all you need to know is if, if you are on the fence about this game, like if you're on the fence and you're somebody who likes zombie games, likes zombie melee combat, get the game. Get the game. I don't, like, the story could be terrible, and it probably will be, honestly. I'm not expecting much from the story. This game's combat is so good, and being able to just call out to zombies is just, it, it's, it's hilarious. It's hilarious, and it's awesome. Uh, plus, on top of that, Damn Buster Studios deserves some some serious praise again this is series s series s hasn't gotten the most love as of late we've got fov sliders not showing up on series s and in a time when that's the case damn buster studios is giving you an fov slider all the way up to 160 fps default by default at 60 fps and it's smooth as butter smooth as butter whether you turn that fov up or leave it the way it was it's smooth I didn't notice a single drop frame, and I played that intro three times at this point. I have not noticed a single drop frame. And th this game is super well optimized, incredibly fun, incredibly violent. YouTube is going to hate this video, but I, I don't I don't care. YouTube doesn't care about me. So I'm going to get this uploaded. You guys should check it out. Leave a comment down below. Let me know if you have checked it out. Let me know if you're going to play it tonight when you get home from work or whatever. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you're thinking about the game, what your experience has been. Leave a like if you like the video. And if you're enjoying this kind of content and you want to stay up to date with it going forward, the best way to do that is consider subscribing. Consider ringing the notification bell because that helps you stay up to date with everything that happens over here on the channel. And it helps push the videos out to more people. Helps me in the algorithm. And I really do appreciate that. And with that being said, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.